The Copper Country has become well known for its excellent and award-winning schools, and now it has one more to add to the list. TV6's Houghton Hancock Bureau reporter Sarah Blakely visited Dollar Bay High School to talk with the students who built a robot that helped them win a national award. Most of us would probably like to forget our high school years, but a few students at Dollar Bay High School have an experience they will always remember. 26 students that make up the Student Organization of Aquatic Robots, or SOAR, have been awarded the National HeartSog Award for volunteer service. The students developed a robot for Isle Royale National Park to keep an eye on the threatening zebra mussel population in Lake Superior. Zebra mussels come in and they layer over your native mussels uh, when they reproduce in high rates they kill them and so we're really concerned about them moving from the Lake Superior Basin into the interior lakes. After Isle Royale contacted SOAR the students began creating prototypes. It was a whole lot of trial and error like hardly anything that I can think of worked on the first try. It was try this, look up how to fix what we just did wrong, we burnt out a wire, replace it with a new one within 10 minutes or so and keep trying. But eventually they constructed a complex robot that would impress even the brightest of engineers. Programming is basically what makes it work, but physically what makes it work are our bilge pump motors, a lot of wiring, a lot of electrical tape. There's a ton of components in it. If you were to get into all of them, we'd be here for a long time talking. The robot was created and designed entirely by students. It's able to be maneuvered around using this controller and it can even take video. And the next step, creating an app. We're working with Michigan Tech now to get that app down and um, we're looking at actually streaming our video so once we get the video coming in we can immediately broadcast it and whoever wants to watch it can connect to our computer and watch it. The project will be passed down to new students who take the class and keep improving. Sarah Blakely, TV6 News, Dollar Bay.